Hey, this is Amy Fox with the Food and Mood Lab. You are what you eat, but that's only part of the story. I've got nutrient absorption on my mind. Yes, nutrient absorption. I recently saw a statistic that said 92% of Americans have some sort of nutrient deficiency. That sucks. When you have a nutrient deficiency, you feel like crap. So here are some ideas and ways that you can avoid that. And by the way, don't Google this because it will blow your mind. It's complicated and overwhelming like most nutrition information on the internet. First is to make sure that you're eating whole foods. Probably a no-brainer, but you're 90% there if you're eating whole foods. If you don't know what I mean by whole foods, uh, you wanna eat foods that have the fewest ingredients possible. Foods that aren't in a box or a bag. So, by the way, when you're eating fast food, you're eating crap food, that's actually a trigger or can lead to nutrient deficiencies. So start by checking the quality of your diet. Second is to look at your plate. Are you eating a variety of different foods? Do you have different colors on your food? And are you changing up how you cook your foods? So mod, like change it up, steam, raw, so do that. But do you want to up level your nutrient absorption? I know you do. Make sure you think about buying local. When you buy local, you'll actually preserve, you'll, you'll likely um, have more nutrients in those fruits and vegetables. When fruits and vegetables are harvested, within 72 hours, they lose between 15 and 60% of their nutrients. So think about it. When you go to the grocery store, it has to travel from somewhere, right? So you're likely buying produce that already is degraded. Last tip, store your produce in the fridge. Fruits and veggies do not like light and heat. They will also lose nutrients that way. So would love your questions. Let me know what other topics you wanna to hear about. Thanks and make it a great day.